Hi everyone, it's Stockmo here. It is Friday morning. We got a lot of good things here. I got cats running rampant. It's, you know, basically the eve of Neo Day and Tesla Cat is loving it. It's a great green day yesterday. Hopefully it carries into today, but we're going to be talking about two big plays that I think could be added to anybody's portfolio. And that is SBE, better known as Switchback, who is merging with ChargePoint. And of course, I wanna give you my update. I got my Neo shirt on today, I'm ready for it. And I think we're gonna have some big movement over the next few weeks in the right direction for both of these stocks. So stick around, I think you're gonna like what I got for you. Everything I talk about today is for entertainment purposes only. For those that don't know me, I am Stock Mo. I'm an old educator. I used to teach college level and high school level investing, finance, all kinds of different classes. And now I come on to YouTube. I also used to be a financial advisor. So I have quite a history about me, but I put it all together, found a little new career on YouTube and I'm loving it. So thank you for everyone that makes that happen. If you haven't subscribed though, please hit that subscribe button, become part of the community here and just help grow this up to 300,000. Once we do, I'm gonna have a live stream just to celebrate. I like doing that every 100,000 and it gives us a, a good time just to answer questions and say thank you to everyone. Now, I also have some links down below. I have my Weeble link, four free stocks. Let's start the, the weekend out right. You hit that link, you'll get four free stocks for putting in a hundred bucks. And you know, and I think the stocks are anywhere from, I think you get a total of $21 all the way up to 3,700 in free stocks altogether. I get one free share for being an affiliate. It helps support the channel and that's important to me. So I also have my link. If you really, really wanna be a direct help, you can click the Patreon link, come on over, support it. And we have monthly tiers and stuff and good stuff over there that you can help us out with. I share all my stock picks when I buy, when I sell, I have all my portfolios over there. You get to see everything I'm invested in and I have uh, a Google Sheets that update. I think they're almost live, 15 minute delays, but you get to see everything I'm doing and how I'm doing and it's kind of fun. So it's just a good way to support me and I appreciate that too. So let's get into it. We have a lot of big things right now. I'm gonna give you my SBE stock price prediction, my NEO stock price prediction for this next week, because I think a lot of people wanna know, is it gonna be sell on the news or what are we looking at? And I got my own predictions for that. The first thing I wanna look at is SBE. For those who've been with me since the beginning, way back when I first brought this to YouTube, we are up over 147% now. So a lot of people have been asking me, is it a good time to get into SBE? Should we wait post-merger? You know, they're all very good questions. We did have a good run up at this point. I wasn't too sure, but now we've seen this drop because this thing went from all the way up there, all the way back down. And now we're looking at, what is it, uh, 39.90. And I'm liking what I'm seeing as a new entry point because we had a couple of these big ups and downs. And what I mean by that, I even have the numbers down here. We have a 42% drop at one point, a 26% drop at one point, and a 31% drop at one point. So these drop points, oh, you always hear people say, hey, I wanna buy back in once we have a decent drop. Well, we're getting those decent drops. And that's what I mean about getting a new price point to see what's going for. Now, the overall question might be, is this a good stock to buy? You know I'm big on it. Uh, I've been re reading it, and they own 73% of the North American market for uh, any of the chargers out there that run on the 240 volts, and that's big. That's 73% of the market. Now you might wonder, how big is the market, Ma? What's going on? What are we talking about? Well, a lot of the charging market from what I'm reading here is looking to be in 10 years, uh, 2030, they're expecting it to be worth $60 billion altogether. Now that's exciting in itself if you're willing to hold this stock for 10 years, if you have a long-term retirement account, not everything, you know, anybody that follows this channel, this channel is more of the long-term stocks. I'm not here for the day-to-days. I like to buy these stocks I think will dominate a market, go up multiples over the 10 years and just really reward us for being patient and being with the best companies out there. And to me, SBE is going to be that one when it comes to the charging units. Now, I said 60 billion by 2030. If you're gonna be there 20 years, they're expecting that market to go from 60 billion all the way up to $180 billion market, possibly by 2040. So that's 20 years out there. Now, I'm, I'm not gonna be surprised in 20 years, I'm still doing these videos and I still own that stock and we're saying it's up you know, 5,000, 10,000%. Wouldn't that be awesome? But you just never know when you got these kind of numbers working with you. And now, after that, they have 145 million 
in revenue in 2019. They are estimating, because when you look at this stock, you're saying, all right, Mo, we're buying this. You know, what are we looking at for a five year? Because I always like to talk about the five year. So based on what they had of 145 million revenue back in 2019, they are estimating that they should be up to approximately to 2 billion in revenue, more than 10 times. It's getting closer to 15 times their money by 2026. So that's five years from now, we'll be in 2026. They're roughly gonna have 2 billion in expected revenue by then. That is a huge increase from where we are now. So if I tell you a company's gonna go up 10 times, almost 15 times the revenue in the next five years, and you're looking at a company like this and you, you can see the growth continuing past that, this is a long-term buy. Now for the day-to-days, I can't help you with that. I can't tell you where this is gonna go. I don't buy stocks for day-to-days. I don't buy them for month to month. I buy them for year to year. And this one right now, I told you three big drops right here. 42%, 26%, 31%. They are big. But right now we're looking, we're at, down at the bottom of this one. And this thing could easily go back up. So we're at 40 and it goes back up to 50, which I highly suspect it will with Biden, a full Democratic uh, uh, Congress. They're gonna be spending boatloads of money and giving tax credits and everything to the green industry, if you will. And that's the EV, that's the charging, that's everything. And I've been talking about that for a long time that Biden wanted to do five over 500,000. I heard somebody come out and tell me it was 575, 575,000 in the next uh, charging units in the next 10 years. I'm not sure I had it at 500,000, but if it's 575, it's even better. But the point is, I don't know if he would have got that done, but with a full uh, house being in the Senate being Democratic and he's the, uh, the tiebreaker, we know they can probably get this done. And that tells me that this stock looks even better. And I still have it in there. I'm not selling, I'm holding it. I'm gonna be holding this thing a lot longer now. And, and it's looking very good. So that's my thought process behind SBE. Is it a good time? Well, we're looking at the chart right here. Here is a, this would be a buy, up, down, retest the bottom, didn't make it, went back up, went past this. This is technical stuff. I usually don't trade that way, but I'm gonna tell you something. This is one of them times I think I'm gonna. And you can see it going up, retesting, retesting, and it just keeps going higher the next time. I feel like we're there again. I do feel like there is an opportunity there and I'm going to be taking advantage of it. And I do see SBE being a big mover moving forward. And I have some really good stuff that I think uh, this stock could give us moving forward. And I think I might be taking a little bit more advantage of this and adding a couple more dollars to the old portfolios with uh, SBE in there. I like this stock, I like where it's going. Hopefully you can agree with me. I know we had a big pop over the last day. Uh, and this week's been a good week for everyone and I'm happy for all, all the EV people out there. I always said that you can make a boatload of money in clean energy, uh, EV products, and a lot of the, the vertical integration throughout that industry. It doesn't always have to be all the, the companies, the big oil and everything else. It can be companies that make the world a better place and cleaner and, and all that good stuff. And I, I've been saying that since August. And for those who've been with me on this journey, we've done it, we've done well. I can tell you a lot of the portfolios I'm in are killing the market. They're, we are outpacing the market by multiples, just like I, I was hoping, and it's going well. And so the one thing I do have, I didn't give you the update. We had the update to the, the YouTube viewer's choice portfolio, and I'll show you that right now. So here we go, we got the viewer's choice portfolio down below, and this is the one where I'm putting $4,000 in a week of different stocks picked by the viewers of YouTube in this channel. And I like what you did for the first week. You picked uh, you picked NEO, and NEO at the end of this week so far, we've got one more day left, this is today, Friday, and we'll see how this makes out, but we are at 3.24% before market open on Friday, which you know I'm loving that kind of gain. I can take that gain every single week. And we're up 131 bucks off that four grand and I greatly appreciate it. For those who don't know, after 52 weeks, we will have $208,000 in this portfolio. And I'm looking forward to see what all the choices are that you make to help grow this. My goal is to see this thing go over 250,000 by December 31st. We'll see if that happens. I think we're gonna be on that track looking real nice. But you know, we're doing some dollar cost averaging into a portfolio with 50 position, or 52 positions. We'll see how it makes out. So I do appreciate everybody being a part. I will be putting a new, 
uh, five stocks out on the community pages. And you'll see that if you're subscribed to my channel, you'll get to see these picks. And these are ones that I like. So these are, I talk about Neo a lot, but now you're gonna get to see a lot of the other stocks I like outside of the EV, different industries. And then you can vote on which ones you think are gonna be the best ones. And sometimes I'll even throw five penny stocks out there. So this is a great opportunity for everyone to get involved and be a part of this and just grow this together. All right, so now that we talked about that, we do have, we do have right here the NEO stock price prediction I see, and you can see very similar to SB. This went down, SB was down, but this one's already worked its way back up. SB is at this, this stage, so I like where this is going. I do think we're gonna go above the 57.20 very soon. I thought there was a chance that we could get above uh, I thought we could get a, above 60 this week, but obviously that would take about a 10% gain for tomorrow. I don't see that happening, and we're gonna have to watch what we're doing here. So when you see this chart, you have to understand that this is a nice growth going up, and now we're gonna retest that. I think if we can finish above 57.20, we will break out and we will move up to that next level, which I think, like I said before, I can see this going all the way up to 90 to $100 by the end of 2021 and now with that whole shift in power down in DC I think this uh, that that forecast is looking even better so I'm not going to be surprised if it goes at the higher end but we'll have to wait and see it's been a rough ride but this thing has gone up a ton since we bought it and I do see good things for Neo Day we know there could be some surprise announcements and let's hope they're big and you know the autonomous driving software is a big one I'm looking for because if they can somehow jump that up above the competitors, this stock could take off. So we'll be watching. You know I do remember Tesla when their battery day and what happened afterwards. But with Neo, it was, it's a little different. The last four times they did it, two times they went up, two times they went down. In the long run, both of them ended up. You know we moved to where we are now, so I'm happy with it, and we'll see what's going to happen. So happy Friday, everyone. Hopefully we have a nice green day. We can go into the weekend, celebrate, see what's going on with Neo, and take it from there. So go ahead and take advantage of the links down below for the Weeble stocks. You get four of them for a hundred bucks. You put a hundred bucks in, you get four free ones, I should say. You can't beat that. And of course, come over and join us at the Patreon. I'll give you something to do all weekend. And we have a private chat room that is just on the Discord, which is tied right to our Patreons. And it's only for those members that come over. It'd be a great way to help me out. And you can talk stocks with us all weekend long. It's a lot of fun. So thanks for stopping by. Let's get out there and make some money. Thank <laughs> you.